G'day everyone and welcome back to another Catch Up with Kiralee. On this channel we talk about all things cosplay, costuming and sewing related and if you're new here, hi, I'm Kiralee. So today we are going somewhere very, very exciting. We are going to the warehouse of Super Cheap Fabrics. Now, you know that I love Super Cheap Fabrics. I've made many orders online from them um, and I am just so thrilled to be in Melbourne and have the opportunity to actually go to their warehouse. I've cleared it with them and I'm going to take you with me. So come join me. Let's see if I buy any more fabric. Slash how much fabric will I buy? Hey. All right, we have just arrived and I want to show you what I'm saying. So I'm here with the absolutely amazing Zarin of Super Cheap Fabrics. She has been so helpful for us for the past, I don't know how long we've been here, like an hour or something looking through all it's the fabrics. It's been fun. It's been so much fun. Yeah. So how long has Super Cheap Fabrics been around? Um, to my knowledge, it's been around over 30 years. We've had shops before we went online, we've had shops for about 15 years. Wow. Um, and all our shop fronts actually just closed stage two lockdown. Oh, so gosh. since then, and we've we've sort of had the online to set up two years before, but it wasn't really big until COVID hit. Hmm. So when COVID hit, we had no choice but to uh, really expand the online mm -hmm. and do a lot more advertising. And that's how come all of you guys know us <laughs> now. It's true. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, we, we have been in business for over, he's my boss has been in business for over 30 years. Wow. I've been working for him for 14 years now. Wow. So it's, it's a long time. Had some long service leave already, yeah? Um, I, I do. I, I go overseas <laughs> every couple of years. Hey. I'm, 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 I'm waiting. I've got two years now. <laughs> oh, so excellent. in two years, I like to take off like four, about four to six weeks. <laughs> So I save up for it, so I can go. <laughs> Excellent. And are you a seamstress yourself? Do you I like am. Sewing? Yeah. I do sew. Do you uh, get tempted by all the fabrics that come oh, through here? Hun, we all hoard fabric. <laughs> It's worth working this is, here. <laughs> this is like like my dream like hoard. This is like a, a, a dragon's it's, den it's of, of really fabric. It's a thing. I'm like, do I really need it? I've got so much. It's like, <laughs> the, if you see my place and 14 years, like 14 it's a years. long yep. time to collect fabric. I have a lot. Yeah. So like most of, and I know from my customers, if we buy 10 pieces, we're lucky to sew two. <laughs> yes. 80% of us are fabric hoarders, yep. and that is quite normal for everyone. I Look, I you honestly know? believe that sewing is one hobby and, and collecting fabric is another is one. Is another. Yep, I definitely say yes. that. Yeah, beautiful. So working working here, I'm like, this is really nice, and, and I, at least I get to think about it until I find, like, it's nearly finished, and I'm like, do I really want it or do I not? <laughs> <laughs> but yep, yeah, it's... No. Fair it's enough. it's really hard. It's yeah. a very tempting. Yeah. And another question that I would love to ask is because I, I mean I can really only speak from the fabric that is in Perth and we've got very limited selections in Perth. I'm not sure if you're aware. We have Spotlight, we've got Homecraft, which is great, but it's a little bit more on the pricier end. And then we've got a one store called Beautiful Fabrics, which is literally like $60 top, a meter top starting end, yes, kind yes. of fabric. So like to, to come here and well, firstly go online and you know shopping online multiple times yeah. um, and then finally coming here my question to you is how have you guys been able to really keep the price so affordable like this is probably mm. some of the most affordable fabrics within Australia and also such a good selection as well okay my boss is like what he does <laughs> number two he likes to keep the price low mm. so we make our profit from quantity mm. um, and so the turnarounds quicker and mm. it's nicer for the customers have because we're not a wholesaler yeah. so we'll get a certain amount in mm. and he'll mark up what what he's happy mm. uh, with the profit so we can get different fabrics all the time for okay. you guys Amazing. which is which is much better than having the same fabric forever mm. so yeah it's, it's there's, a, there's a there's a turnaround so we strive um, 
you know, to, to, to sell out of fabric so it keeps it more interesting for yeah. us sewers and, and for us working here, cutting fabric the same fabric over and over, it would it's get boring, boring. It would so we want different things to look at as well <laughs> beautiful, look thank you so much for agreeing to have this little interview with me, oh, you're so welcome thank you so much for the amazing help that you gave us all today and oh, just very the welcome. experience, I'm glad that Terry was able to like use his guns and help yeah, you with some of the fabric, yeah. <laughs> yeah muscles aren't here today, <laughs> that's all good Jordan's but thank you so much, we've had had an absolute blast so thank it's you. been a pleasure having you guys here <laughs> all right well absolute pleasure. see you later see you guys <laughs>and I wanted to do a quick kind of show and tell of that which I got. I've got two bags of fabric here which are all mine. Terry also got a bag of fabric for himself as well but I just want to share you what I've got. So first off let me show you the remnants that I selected. So yes they have a room that is just full of remnant fabrics and oh my goodness it was so much fun to sort through. So the very first thing that I got was a remnant of this beautiful lace fabric. I have, I've actually seen this one on their website and I have always really liked it. So that when I saw that they had a remnant of it, I was like, yes, please. Isn't that so awesome? And like the cool thing is, is that quite a number of these flowers, you could easily cut them out and have them as individual appliques. So I thought, hmm, quite a few different uses of this particular one. So there's that one. I also got this orange velvet because velvet and scrunchies are good. Next, we also have another cheetah velvet because once again, velvet and scrunchies are good. Then I have this beautiful piece of fabric which has like embossed roses on it and it's really, really pretty. I think there is only about, yeah, it's just under a meter. It's about it's about um, 1.5 meters wide, but yeah, I just really liked it. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with it just yet, but yes, I do very much like it. And then the last piece of remnant that I got was this fantastic piece of fabric, which is a jersey and it's um, got a flower pattern, but it has a black stripe through it as well. Mm -hmm. Isn't it so pretty? <laughs> So there is, this is actually not like a remnant remnant. This is about two meters worth of it. So I adore this. I'm not sure what I'm going to make out of it, but yes, I mean, there's enough in there to make a little dress or some really cool pants. I'm actually leaning towards some really fun, easy fitting pants with that one. I think that with the stripes, it would just look amazing. So they were the remnants. And then the rest of, fa of the fabric that we got was in this bag. So we got this red kind of lycra, which uh, Terry wanted for one of his cosplays. So we got some of that. Then we got this very, very fancy fabric, which I have no idea what I'm going to use. But I saw it and I just, I loved how it looked like. Um, just like brushed gold. So there's this fabric here to see if I can pick it up in the sun. See that? Like it's just so lovely. The texture is just really, really lovely. And it's actually very lightweight for the type of fabric that it looks like. It does have metallic threads in it, but yeah, it's just super gorgeous. So I got three meters of that because when you're unsure, get three meters. <laughs> Uh, someone once said to me that if you get three meters, you can make a dress. And I don't know, that's always stayed with me. Uh, so yes, I just get three meters if I'm unsure of how much how much I want to buy of it. The next two fabrics go together. So this fabric, which is this really cool um, kind of like bright yellow. And I think it looks a little bit greenish as well. Terry swears that it's not. Um, but it's yellow and black um, and he saw this and he just fell in love with it and so did I and he said I want a jacket made out of that 
So he's gonna learn how to sew and he's gonna make it himself. But I said to him, you can't make a full jacket out of this, otherwise that's gonna be really, really bright. And um, knowing Terry and his personality, I'm not sure if he would feel comfortable necessarily wearing a bright, bright yellow uh, jacket everywhere. So I encouraged him to also get this black, or rather I got it because I purchased it, but this beautiful black that is a similar texture to that, or at least a complementary texture to it, which, you know, we could do panels in the yellow and then panels in the black and um, sleeves as well. And, you know, that will just look really, really nice. So there we are, there's those two. So the last two fabrics I'm very excited about because it is silk. And you guys know that I love me some silk. So, what I have here is two lots of Silky Peony, but it's such a high grade of Silky Peony that it's almost like a pure taffeta. It's gorgeous. So, I have about a meter, just under a meter, of this brown. It was a remnant, and it's just this beautiful kind of chocolate kind of brown. I adore it. I find that I don't use a lot of browns, but when I do, it's very, very specific, and I don't have a lot of browns. So I'm very glad that I've got this, add it to the stash. And then I got some more white. Eh, mm, mm, I love it. I still have quite a few meters of this that um, is currently sitting with my friend, but I adore having just some white silk uh, because it is so, so versatile and it's so pretty. So there's currently four meters of this. Uh, I just got what was left on the roll and I couldn't be happier. Anyway guys, those are my fabrics. I am so, so excited to use all of these and also for Terry to use his ones because you know, he's got his uh, ones that I showed you here and also his own that he picked. Uh, yeah, so tell me, what is your favorite fabrics out of my haul? Did you see any that you liked? It's super cheap fabrics as I like showed you around the floor. And guys, honestly, if you haven't already, do check them out. I will leave the link to Super Cheap Fabrics in the description and they do ship internationally. They have some of the most amazing, amazing fabrics. And I will tell you, honestly, their staff are just absolutely lovely. I honestly have never had a better experience with a fabric company in my entire life from ordering online to being there in person they were so so lovely i know that if i've ever had an issue previously with fabrics they have come back immediately and fixed the issue they're just that they're all about the quality and also you know obviously the quantity of the fabrics as well and they keep it at such a fantastic and reasonable price. They have sales all the time. When I was there, they were so busy because they just finished a massive sale. And yeah, you guys should definitely support them if you can. They're just a small comp small family owned company. They're lovely, lovely human beings. And their fabric is fabulous. They've got such an amazing selection. Anyway, guys, I'm going to stop rambling there. I do want to send out a massive thank you to the Super Cheap family and business. You guys are fabulous. Thank you so much for entertaining myself and my husband and my two friends when we came in and we're like, hey, <laughs> we're here. Thank you so much for humoring us and just being the most welcoming and loving grouping of people. All right, guys, thank you so much. I'll stop mushing on about it all. Have a wonderful day, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.